Hey everyone, in this tutorial I'm going to show you guys how to take a video of your programs running. This is really important for not only this assignment, but also the AP exam. You'll actually complete a project for the AP exam where you have to record your program running. So let's go through it. So when you're recording a video, you want to use an application called QuickTime. QuickTime. And as you can see, the icon for QuickTime on my computer is below, but it's possible that it's not there for you. So in order to find it, you can go up to the magnifying glass, aka spotlight search, and look for QuickTime, like so. Okay, so you should be able to find this, you can click on it, and it will ultimately open QuickTime so that you have these tabs at the very top of your page. Your goal is to click on file and then a new screen recording. Well, because I am recording my screen right now, I can't click on that. But I do want to say that when you open that, you will see two things. You'll first see this. It's a little box that will pop up somewhere on your screen. And you have to make sure that your audio is turned off. So make sure that you click this little downward arrow next to the recording button before you actually take your recording. Okay? We want to make sure you don't have any audio. So turn your microphone off. Then you can click record. Once you click on the record button, you'll see this message, right? It says click to record the full screen or drag to record a part of the screen. So you can drag like so, or like so, to get just portions of your screen. And that's what I want you guys to do, is just drag over, drag over your music player so that you can show me what happens when you click on each of your new artists and new songs, okay? I don't want to see your name anywhere within the video. That's really important to practice because the AP exam does not want to see your name or any identifying information in the video that you submit for your final project. So that should be it. Once you're done with the video, you just click on the QuickTime player and then um, command control escape and when you do that you should be able to end your video command so once you make your recording your video will hopefully save to your desktop like so so here's my video on how to record this video and we need to make sure that it's something that you can get a link for because you need to copy and paste your link below so the way that we're going to do this is by uploading new content to YouTube. So you can go to YouTube and then just click on this little create a video or post. And then you can drag your video there. So this is going to take some time, but you'll notice that on to the left we have a link. This is the link that I need to see your video um, for the assignment. So you would just copy and paste that uh, here. Okay. And that's all I need to see your video. But don't forget that you need to publish the video. I won't be able to see it unless you publish it, like so. Okay, so that'll take some time, but you can always copy and paste this link over and let the processing happen. I'll still be able to see it, even if you copy this before it's done with the processing. Awesome, that should be it.